Okay, for our varsity football games where we have over a thousand people in attendance, it, we can't do microwave popcorn. You can't make the popcorn fast enough. So we're gonna use our oil-based popcorn machine. Now, again, that's only for varsity football games, so we're only gonna use this a few times this season. First of all, someone must man this machine at all times when it's popping. Do not walk away from the machine. It moves very quickly. There's a lot of heat and oil involved in this. It will burn if you walk away from it. First, before you begin, you want to clean the machine, okay? So open it up. You're gonna, you can take these pieces out. It, it all kind of comes apart. There's a tray here. You're gonna want to wipe it all down. You'll wipe the sides down. Uh, they get everything all cleaned up, make it nice and shiny. It's nice and clean right now. It's ready to start popping. Now, this piece in here, it needs to be cleaned too. Now, you could take this off. It does lift out. It lifts out, and, uh, and this unplugs right here. And if you need to, you can take it over, take it over to the sink that's behind me, and you can rinse this all out. It all comes apart. Give it a nice little wash down, and then dry it all off and bring it all back in here. Make sure it's dry before you start using it. So you're gonna plug in the heating element, you're gonna plug in the unit into the wall over here, and then you're gonna turn on all three of these switches, the heating element, the motor that rotates the, the, uh, the corn in the, in the heating element, and then the warming light. Get all those on. Now it takes like four or five minutes for it to initially heat up. You might smell some things burning off that, you know, if there's anything still stuck in the, in the heating element, but you gotta give it a full four or five minutes before you try to pop the corn. Now once it's hot, you don't have to wait that long between, uh, between poppings. Okay, so then you're gonna find your oil, and your butter and oil and your corn. These are in this container right here. And you're gonna go through these pretty quickly when you start making a batch of popcorn. Okay, so you're gonna grab some scissors and you are going to cut across the top here, all the way across the top of both sides. And then when this is good and hot, you're gonna lift that up and you are gonna dump the oil in first and, and the corn all into that bin at the same time. It should be turning, it should be hot, it's going to start cooking quickly. Make sure that part is down on both sides, on both sides, make sure they're down and it will start cooking very quickly. It'll start popping and you need to, again, do not walk away from it while you're doing this. Stay close to the machine and listen, listen carefully, okay? Um, as soon as it stops popping, because it's gonna be like, pop, 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 it's gonna end quickly. You need to then use this handle and you gotta dump all the popcorn down into the, into the bin at the bottom. Get it out of this heating element, okay? Now, then have another one of these ready to go. Lift this up, add the next one in. It will start popping right away. You will fill, it'll take probably five or six of these pockets before you even fill up the bottom of this thing, but it will, it will go very quickly. You'll be able to pop the corn very fast. Okay, once you've got enough, then um, you can turn off the, uh, the heating element and the motor if you're done and you've got enough popcorn down there. Um, and then you're gonna wanna find these popcorn bags, which are, which are also in there. You will take them out with gloves on. You will take a bag out. You will find a spatula from over here, one of these spatulas, and you will scoop the popcorn and fill the bag, and then you will place those bags over here in this, in this rack right here where the microwave popcorn goes as well. When the supply gets low, again, you'll turn the heating element back on and the motor, wait till it gets hot again, and repeat the procedure with several more bags to refill the content in the bottom. Now this is important as well. Once it gets to the fourth quarter of, of the football game, stop making any more popcorn. Use up all the popcorn that's in this machine. If anybody wants popcorn after you've used all that popcorn and sold it all, use the microwave popcorn at the very end. We don't want to be making a huge batch of this popcorn at the end of the game because it, you know, it'll just go to waste and, and it's a big mess to clean up. Okay, when you're done, you serve all the popcorn, you're gonna wipe it all down again, you're gonna clean it all out, dump the extra popcorn in the trash can, wipe all the surfaces down, and close it up. Thank you.